So I got this question on one of my most recent videos, asking if X-Men was made now, would the writers make as much discrimination in the universe as there was in the past, especially with popular properties like My Hero Academia, where there's a slight variation of mutations known as quirks. And my answer to that is, Yes and no. But let me explain. In the world of My Hero Academia, about 80% of people have quirks. Basically, you throw a stone into a crowd, you're gonna hit someone with powers. Which also means, most likely, world governments are gonna be made up of people with those powers. Now let's juxtapose that with the X-Men. Similar concept, people born with these innate powers, each of them different with their own special abilities. However, in the Marvel Universe, there's like a 0.4% chance that you're gonna have the X gene. So at this point, it basically becomes a numbers game. In the My Hero Academia universe, no, there's not gonna be any kind of discrimination unless you don't have powers, considering that would be in the minority, roughly 20%. However, in the X-Men universe, even if it's created in the modern times, unless they adjust the formula and say a greater percentage of humans have the X-Gene, they're still gonna be in the extreme minority. And okay, let's be completely real here. Public approval or not, governments are gonna weaponize them. But let me know what you think in the comments.